Hello and welcome back to Biotope Aquarium Simulator. Uh, we are at the uh, Neon Nursery here. This is the nursery. We have uh, five fish at the bottom and we've got one way down there too. What is he? Is he... I think we have four here. I'm not sure what this one is. Now if they die, they float to the top. So uh, we'll have to check on that the next time. I have added a new plant. I went to the store and bought a plant. It said it would be good for cichlids, or, yeah, cichlids, but uh, it didn't do too well in the water. So I moved it over here, and this is it here. Everything else is doing good. Uh, everything else is in the green. The fish are happy. Uh, the little fish are happy as well. So they're doing good. These are the ones I did not sell. And um, let's take a look. I want to show you here because this is... The two, uh, let's see. This tank had the tutorial tank had black neon tetras in it, and they were stressing. They were stressing, and we put uh, you know six, a total of six because that's what it says. I like to run in groups of four to six or six to eight or something like that. So we bought uh, we had six. The neon stress level they love it. Black neon tetras didn't like it. They were stressing. Now, maybe it was because there's too many uh, neons in this tank. I like a lot of neons, so I'm not going to sell any of my neons to, you know, make the black neon black tetras, black neon tetras uh, stress level go down. So I moved them over into tank two, which was a new tank. We were just letting it set up. <clears throat> so... I've got this tank here and their stress level is zero. So I don't know really what happened over in the other tank. I don't know why they they were stressing. Um, they have really good uh, uh, parameters here. And they had them over there. I, I think it was the amount of fish in that tank. So these are a little bigger, I think, than the neons. So. So we moved them over here. We're going to see what happens uh, here. Let's go to the third tank. Yeah, this is the neon tank. So when we were just in, let's take a look at the Swedes tank. This one, they were stressing. They were like at 4.8. I mean, that's not bad, but they were at 4.8. And we added a couple of more fish here. A couple of males. A couple of females over on this side. And taking a look at their stress level zero. Let's see what his is. Oh, let's see what his is. In case she is the newest one. Yep, zero. So, I don't know why they were stressing. I did throw another rock in. And then, of course, when I put that plant in over here in the corner, it didn't do too well. It, it wasn't happy at all. So, I don't know if that has something to do with the, you know, the ammonia nitrogen. I have no idea. No idea. No idea. They said less plants in here. I was going to take some of these out and put that in, but it didn't work. It didn't work. So our third, and maybe the temperature, uh, maybe the temperature was high, uh, 23, and the pH was high, maybe. Maybe that plant didn't like it. Then we go to our um, Black Widow Tetra tank, and we have more fish fry down here. We have more fish fry here, here, and here. I think we have 17 new fish in this tank, plus the old ones back here in this tank. So this tank has a lot of fish in it. A lot of fish in it. <laughs> uh, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22, 23, 24, plus 25, 26, 29. So about, about 30 fish in here. Nothing at the top. No, we're good. Okay. <laughs> Nothing at the, they seem to like it. I mean, everything's doing good. Everything's doing good. So, uh, about this extra fish, we were selling them. But because it's getting close to day seven, and the game calculates how many happy fish I have at the end of the week, I'm going to leave these in a couple of more days. And I think they, um, they have a couple of days. Uh, 10 hours and then they'll become something else uh, until hatching and then they're 
they're called something else, and then they metamorphose. I think these ones back here in the back are wait, awaiting metamorphosis. Yeah, 19 days until metamorphosis. So, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to sell these. I'm not going to sell them. I'm going to keep them till the end of the week and see what happens. Uh, I may get extra experience points or dollars for... I did get extra experience points. Here's the... Um, yeah, level 8. So, we're right there. Level 8. That's just almost from raising fish. Or breeding fish. So... Uh, here is our a couple of fish purchases this week, a new plant, a couple of new plants, I believe, and new decorations. So, rocks. I may have to be getting into buying rocks with this. Uh, I, I just don't, uh, I just don't want to sell them right yet. And and here I've sold 26 fish yesterday or two days ago, I guess it was. <clears throat> that if I'd kept them. And the tank would have been good come that seventh day. Would I have um, would I have made a lot more money? I don't know. Here it's 10 o'clock. We're going to go ahead and feed them. I'm not feeding them a whole lot now. I'm kind of backing down on the food. So we've got 3.8 grams. So we'll do that. There they go, and I'm sure those little fish fry aren't getting any. Are these little fish aren't getting any? But I think that what that does is it puts nutrients into the water. So these little guys can pick it off of the leaves, I guess, or out of the ground. I have no idea. It's going back to the next tank. Uh, we'll start at the tutorial tank. <clears throat> this was my, you know, this was my neon, and the guppies were doing good. So after I, well, let's let's uh, buy the fish first. Uh, I mentioned we were going to go with guppies, and there was another one up here that was very peaceful. And they tried two of those, but what if they don't? <laughs> what if they don't like it? I don't have another tank to put them in. So the guppies were doing good. I just let them go. I guess I, I waited a day and they weren't ready. So we're going to get. Um, We're gonna get two guppies. I, I don't care what they are, so let's see what they the, what they become. We bought two of those. Let's go ahead and drop them in, and then feed the fish. There's my guppies. Guppies. Throw some food in there for them. That's one point, and this is a bigger tank, so I yeah. Uh, <clears throat> we'll do that. There the guppies go. How are they doing? They're good. So let's hope I can keep these guppies <laughs> keeping them alive. Let's go to our next tank, which is the black neons. These little black neons. They're, they're, they're good looking. They want a lot of shade. Stress, good. Little pH a little too high, but that's alright. And breeding, there's they're not ready. So let's go ahead and feed my little black neons. So yeah, one click jumped it up to three inside here. So and I have three left there. We're gonna apply that. Watch them go. And it seems like these guys are a little bit more active. They're all over the tank. They're high, they're low. I know the neons kind of kind of school together back and forth through the middle. Oh, he went in the barrel. I know you're not ready for breeding. And he came back out. <clears throat> so they they like this tank. Uh, it's a it's a small tank, so maybe the small small fish like this, and they don't like to be crowded with other fish. I have no idea. If it was up to me, I'd have 150 neons in there, but in a bigger tank, in a bigger tank. Uh, let's go to our uh, nursery. These guys need to eat. Yeah, we sold all of our fish except these. They had a pretty nice. Uh, 
DNA ratings, so we kept those. Time to feed the neons. We're not feeding them much. Man, it jumps up, don't it? Oh, over there they went. I got it over there in the corner. It was one in the corner. And I got some grass down here. So just kind of changing the tanks around, buying more of uh, the plants, trying more plants, I guess, uh, to see what happens. We'll have to get some rocks for these, the Swedes here. Female over here. The yellow ones are male, and the blue ones are female. More rocks, less plants. And they want food. And look, it's a big tank. So is there... And these are big fish, so let's go two clicks on that. Maybe up to one. There's not a lot of plants here, so the plants don't need that much. So We'll try it. There we go. Go get it, boys and girls. I think everybody got a piece that time. Oh no, that one back here in the bag, he did. But the nutrients are in the water. So there is our Swedes tank and our new fish in the Black Widow Tetra tank. So a lot of fish, which I am going to hold over. So let's go to the store and buy some rocks for our... Hmm. And what rocks? Which rocks? The red rocks? The big rock? I think this is a big rock. That one's nine. That one's eight. I have no idea if these are big Everglades, huh? Uh, this one looks interesting. This one looks like an interesting rock. Uh, it's 1250. Let's buy two of those. That'll bring us down to 100. I still need to buy food while I'm here. Need to buy fish food. Mac macronutrients. 50% of protein, 8% fat, and 2% carbohydrates. have no idea. And plants. Carolina fanwort. Let's uh, let's buy two of that, and we will see what happens to it. It kind of likes a. Uh, it needs to be almost perfect right there, don't it? It needs to be right there. Uh, let's buy two. Okay, we're down to eighty-five or uh, eighty-two dollars. <clears throat> Now the rocks and the plants, I'm going to go try in the Swedes tank. So we're going to go back to the Swedes tank and uh, work it out there. We have plants. Let's see how this... Oh, they don't like plants. Yeah, well, I'm trying to get rid of the tape. That's what I'm trying to get rid of. Let's just take a look. Oh my god, it's red. Oh my god, oh my god. Get out of there, fan wart. Get out. Don't die on me. Hang in there. <laughs> okay, so they didn't like that. <clears throat> Let's try rocks. Oh, these are small rocks. Um, in the back, maybe. I'm going to have to learn how to adjust these things and turn them. So that they fall the way I want them to fall or something. Well, we'll do it again with this one. Okay, yeah, they look too symmetrical there. we got to uh, do something about that.
I just kind of naturally fail back in there. We'll, we'll see what happens, and we'll take a plant out. Well, the stress level of these plants are fine. Look at this. I mean, these they're fine in here. They're fine with that. Now, what do we do with these? And you got sick on me. Uh, I will have to find a place to put... To put that. But anyway, I am going to leave it here. I hope you liked the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Um, leave me a comment about what I'm doing wrong with these fish. Thanks for watching.